Hello, everybody. No clue if I'm going to be able to fix this piece or not. We can try. Um, I end up just painting over the whole thing. I have a tendency to do that, too. But this one is just a little bit messed up for me. I'm working on it, Sonia. Sorry about the noise, that's a cough drop. That's actually a throat. It's not really cool. A little rough, too. Anyway, so we've got this flower I painted. Flowers. They're not horrendous, they're just, I don't know. Kind of simplistic in their shape and design, I suppose. So maybe we'll use that for background for something else. But what will it be? I actually think it's upside down. I'm just waiting one second before I get going here. So we basically still have our browns and siennas and yellows and, you know, honey mustard color. <laughs> Red. I got one little green and some white. And I had a tiny touch of blue. I think it's cobalt blue. But nothing seriously heavy in colors. Let's see what we can do. I don't know if I really want to paint over it as much as maybe we'll do a wash on it. That's what we'll do. Let's do. Let's put it in the background a little bit. Let's grab some water. Let's put it in the background. That brush seems to be separating pretty bad. Let's use a different brush real quick. Really, I'm using a lot of, I mean, I'm using watercolor paper, so I'm using a lot of water. Start up here, work our way down. Away. Well, except for what I texted you about, I didn't touch that. Ninety-eight um, percent of it's done. Mm. Supposed to get thunderstorms. See, that never happens when you come up here. <laughs> never happens the day before we come up here. Uh. Snow and or <laughs> rain. <laughs> so far, I think that's what you're you're by almost a hundred percent. Yeah, pretty much. It's supposed to be nice here in the morning. Huh? Uh, it's supposed to be a nice weekend for you. Yeah. I will try to get to see you sometime this weekend. I kind of have to. I got stuff to give you. <laughs> but I gotta get Carolyn Carolyn all moved so so it'll probably be later in the evening-ish 
afternoon anyway, you know. What, Saturday? Yeah. Yeah, because you guys are leaving Sunday, right? Or yeah. Monday morning. One of those two. Oh. Nice, this thing stuck to my teeth. Look at that. What are you eating? Or cola. Ooh. With honey. Ooh. Excuse me for one day. Wow. <laughs> Holy moly's. <laughs> what? <sighs> Sinuses are now cleaned out. <laughs> I was gonna say. <laughs> Wow, that one was strong at the end. It's the surprise ending, I guess. I don't know. Ta-da! You didn't know that it was going to taste like this. No, oh, it was like... It's just kind of... I don't know. Just, there's still flowers under there, but... So what else did you guys do today? <laughs> what didn't we do today? <laughs> did everything today. Everything we could think of. We maybe sort of kind of blew up marshmallows in the microwave. Did you make a mess? No, I put them in a giant glass bowl. Yeah. And then we microwaved them for three minutes. <laughs> <laughs> After we had colored them with food coloring. When they went... <laughs> I'm so glad I used that clean saran wrap. <laughs> Did you inject them or you just, you just so, dumped them in? We put uh, water, food coloring in bowls. Yeah. And then we dumped them with toothpicks, you know? Oh, okay. okay. It's fun. You probably could have soaked the holes in the, in the marshmallow and just let them sit in there for a while. We tried that, though. Of course we tried that. They got a little bit of stuff in there, but... They didn't saturate very much, which is surprising. That was actually, we're, you know, another experiment. Where she likes to do experiments. Yeah, I figured they would have soaked it right now. Nope. Oh, great. Apparently we didn't wash this brush last night. She was funny with the butterflies and the fairy emojis. What's that? She was funny with the butterfly and fairy emojis. Oh, I know. It's, oh, what was that? I'm, ec I'm echoing. I don't know. I didn't do anything. Why am I? I turned you to I was echoing bad for a second. Um, yeah, she's going through my emojis. She's like, I like that one. Do whatever you want. <laughs> well, how can I send this one? No. No, we're not going to send that particular one. No, we're, we're going to find something else to use. She did find one or two that we weren't going to use. We're going to go back to the flower, by the way. But we'll I'm back feeling terrible. Is that my end or your end? I don't know. Oh, I'm I'm playing with the hitch pin and and the uh, what you call it? This thing, the clip. Oh, yeah, I keep getting like reverb. It's like a nice, nice, nice 60s car going on here every time I talk. Didn't break it. Not my fault. So where's Jim? Meeting. Oh, well, that's, that's the other story. <laughs> supposed to leave work at 5 o'clock. At 4.15, he gets 
an order form for somebody that some client wanted to order a phone system or whatever. So it took him an hour and five minutes to do all the rest of the paperwork that goes along with the order form. So I called him shortly after you texted me and I said, hey, I'm just calling to see where you're at, you know, blah, blah, blah. And then he starts going on this tyrant about what happened. So I said, all right. He says, well, I'm supposed to be there at like five minutes to eight, I said, which is what I kind of figured he was going to be here. I said, well, we're getting thunderstorms between 7.30 and 9. Do you want me to try and put this hitch on the truck? It's a ten thousand pound hitch, yeah. It's huge. Well, it now it that was... much. Huh? It doesn't weigh that much. No no no, well that's what it can hold. It's a little bit overkill for the for the camper, but <laughs> well, they're yeah. better than the other way than people that use those little one inch receivers trying to pull a thirty five foot trailer. Yeah. I get a kick so... I get a kick out of those. Oh, we picked it up at Walmart World. Whoa. Yeah, but that's made for towing a little utility trailer and actually not even barely those. Yeah. So he says, don't you even think about putting that on? I mean, if I was like <laughs> totally like, I've done it before, but not after certain. Like, you don't want to wreck your arm. Like, okay. Because I usually sit on the ground and I just throw it in there and put the hand, you know, call it done. It's done. But he doesn't want me to do that. So I said, well, it's going to be like porn when you get here. And then you're going to be all mad because you're getting wet and doing the rest of this stuff that you need to do. And uh, so I get wet. I'm all right. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. All right. Whatever. So. I did pretty much everything else I could do. There's like one or two other things I have to do with nothing major. I know I would have gave up and put off the trip myself, but that's just me. You would have what? I would have put off the trip myself. Put it off? Why? <laughs> He's got to leave so quickly and I hate doing weekends. I mean, you're used to it. That's what you do. Yeah. You know, but for me, if I go someplace like that, I'm going for a week, you know. I'm going to drive more than three hours. My butt's not hanging out for a weekend. Although I used to do it when I went to Maine all the time. Go up there for a weekend. Right. Because that's where Sue's dad used to live a long time ago. Wife number three. You know, if it, if it was like a trip to Florida, then it'd probably be a different story. But, you know, it's... it's... So you're not, how far is it from your... Well, this is the whole thing, right? So we pretty much have to... If, if I had a place to keep the camper closer to home, I would have brought it back home. But I have nowhere to put it because we pretty much have to go like we're going back home up the turnpike, up the parkway. We have to, like backtrack, you know. Oh, you <laughs> couldn't put it in your next door neighbor's house? <laughs> in that driveway? Sure, I don't hang out in the road a lot. <laughs> no place for your truck. Yeah, the town be knocking on the door. So what are you gonna do when uh, that gets sold? Park back across the street again, I guess. The other side of the street is a lot wider than our side of the street is, so. You just need to tell your dad that you need it for a birthday present. <laughs> Which is what? The house next door. Oh. <laughs> I don't even know what the heck is going on with that house. It's just like sitting there. It's not even, Zillow hasn't put anything up new about it. So they did about my house. 
Oh, they do reassess it. <sighs> yeah. I wish they'd stop doing that. So eventually that will affect my taxes. Yeah. 125,000 dollars more than I paid for it. Wow. There's a little bit of a profit margin. Yeah. That's how much the yeah. housing up here has gone crazy. Yeah, well, we were talking about that the other night, right? Yeah. Was... Am I on YouTube? You were. I wasn't sure I was watching you. I mean, I show myself there, but I show one person watching. It's probably yourself. Yeah. Yeah, that's all it's here. Wow, I'm bad. I've lost like 11 people or something lately, though. Although it says 121 right now. I mean, uh, 1.21, 121. Yeah, I wish. <laughs> Start all over again, or <laughs> uh, maybe that maybe that's K. You never think of that? Maybe I got a hundred thousand over the weekend. There you go. Wouldn't that be fun? I'm on the uh, other person program. No clue how that's happening, but... Oh, I know, right? I mean, I do know. But that was a big jump in a weekend. That's a lot of people. You need to be careful playing that game. Yeah, because you could, you, you could lose a lot, too to your channel if you're not very very careful mm -hmm. I had to make sure I was actually reading that number right I was like it is oh oh <clears throat> how what that's two days yeah never seen anybody do that well I mean a few people but they paid cash Mm. I mean, TR does that, but you know, he's over 160,000. So, numbers like that are like you and I going up 10. Yeah, yeah. There's definitely a niche, you know, there's certain things that just blow up, and there's certain things that just Oh, well, I kind of expect to stay right around where I'm at. Give or take. I'd like to hit two, 2,000 eventually. But it is what it is. I don't paint regularly enough, I guess, anymore. And I don't paint. You're doing what you can do at the moment. Yeah. I do paint a lot of the same stuff a lot of the time, but... It's just what I feel like painting, so that's what I paint. Yeah. That's what my channel was about. That's what I'm going to do. I can't believe how quiet it is. On a Thursday, it's, it's weird being here on a Thursday. <laughs> I was going to say, it's not a weekend. It was after a long weekend. Yeah. So everybody's like, back to work. Bruce and Lori aren't even here yet. Do they usually get there earlier? Well, they've got him down to work in three tens temporarily. Hey, Kevin. So he, I think he's working Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Hey, Kevin. I just paint what I feel. That's right. So. I 
I gave up really worrying about that stuff. It's just it takes too much out of me. I was work, Kevin. <clears throat> Oh, and I got a pair of shoes. The lady, the, the couple in the cabin across the street from me, she's the one, the lady, she's pretty funny. Every time she sees somebody walk by with a dog, she's like, oh my God, how cute. <laughs> <laughs> I forget. I forget. There's cabins there. Yeah. Well, the one straight ahead. Or there's two of them actually. They're just one room, air conditioning, microwave, bunk beds. You have to bring everything else. But the one down the end of the street was like a modular. So it's got everything in it. Oh, the CEOs came in. Oh, okay. That's one thing I was never worried about. My bosses were there every day. All of them. All three of them at the same time. A lot of the time. Oh, if you're doing what you're supposed to be doing, you don't have anything to worry about. They left me alone. I made them millions of dollars a year. They left me alone. Nice pajama pants there, buddy. Uh-oh. Kevin, you're unemployed tomorrow? <laughs> ooh, ooh. Keep your head down and your nose clean. Kevin's like, yeah. no. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin's like, I just take a different car home every day. <laughs> Oh, you were safe. Okay, good. <laughs> hey, Anthony. Hey, Anthony. I tried to catch your Facebook today, Anthony, but I had a little tiny person hanging out with me all day. Oh, trying to paint over this total disaster that I painted. The flowers are still under there. They're not completely even disappeared. Well, you brought that Renegade home today, Kevin, didn't you? Or was that yesterday? No, I had my granddaughter all day. My wife was gone. We were pretty much one on one for a while. We did a lot of stuff today. We painted. Obviously, anybody that's on Facebook can see that. It was a masterpiece. It was actually, I liked it. She's five. Did all the time. Stupid keyboard does what it wants. I keep it. 
plugged in half the time. It does help when you use the right mouse, though. Yeah, yeah, I have that problem. <laughs> oh, what color? Do we want to do a brown flower? I would never. I mean, well, who paints brown flowers? Nobody. But there are brown flowers, I'm sure. Maybe. I don't know. I'm on the phone, Kevin. I don't really know if there is or not. I wasn't going to unpack the laptop just to pack it back up again. It's just blob. 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 <laughs> blob. Okay. Remind me uh -huh. to get you that stuff. Or I'll have to ship it to him. Oh, you won't forget, trust me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I will. <laughs> Well, you know what I mean. I was being sarcastic. I won't forget. Yeah, sure. I'm going to be moving furniture all day long. And my body is not in any condition to move furniture. What is she using to move furniture with? You home. Okay. But there, our arm that's down here weighs about 300 pounds. Oh, God. You're not going to go riding down the driveway on the skateboard, are you? No. <laughs> Why would you ever do that? Oh, I don't know. It was her fault. It was her fault. <laughs> It wasn't my fault. I didn't plan that. It was just an accidental thing. Yeah. And the, the recliner jumped up and the skateboards slid underneath. And next thing you know, you're, you're rolling down the driveway. It was magic. I don't like that. We were just trying to get the recliner to the end of the driveway. And then I end up having to bring it back up anyway. <laughs> and then it rolled back down again. Three times. Three times. And then you got yelled at. <laughs> More than three times. Why is that mess I just painted? Uh, let's see if I can kind of fix that. Probably not. I don't know. I don't like that right there, though. That's where I run into issues. Every single time, even though I've watched him like a million times. I don't. I get lost right there. Hey, Del. Hey, what's up, Kevin? You have a number two? Too confused calling him Kevin. Oh, Could your Mercedes be dropped any lower? Sure. Wow. That was low. I mean, my. I had to put a rubber skirt on the bottom of my golf because it, the front air dam would hit. Yeah. What did Kevin type? New battery. So 
So that's what you type when you have a new battery. Oh, Dill said second place is the first loser. Kevin said, okay, new battery. No, the part that didn't get shown. Oh, I can't see it. P L O K I J H B G T Y H U J K dot L dot. It's an eye test. Apparently, I passed it. Oh, I forgot to do that. Thanks. Didn't remind me. <laughs> or I knew, or there was on the keyboard again. I knew there was something I was supposed to do this week. <clears throat> Did you reschedule another appointment? Yeah, the ninth. That's something that shows up in the chat when Arnie's cat sits on his on his phone. Usually. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna just lose that in a minute here. Along with control and various other things. Yep, don't like it. And focus. Okay, there we go. God. Let me the brush. Yeah, let's lose the brush. Rinse it off better than we did. Wasn't so rinsed. It's got really tiny. Teeny tiny. How is it Thanks. 73 already? Thanks, Dill. Right. Thanks, Dill. Uh, I'm not going to be out too, too long. Where'd this day go? Huh. You asked me about six hours ago. <laughs> We have to get up at four thirty. Yep. Get a doggy this morning. What are you? Because you have no human. Yep. Do not call her baby. No. That does not work for her. Do I look like a baby to you? <laughs> uh, yeah. Here comes a, here comes a goose. Except she, uh, we have a little exercise uh, trampoline, a little tiny one. One person type of thing, yeah. Uh -huh. she, she used to jump on as a kid. And she used to hit her chin on the crossbar. You know, as a handle for so you can hold it. All right. And now it's at her waist. Wow. I think I just made a heart shape. Did totally by accident. We'll go with it. I really gotta leave these things to him, but I just when I 
I have barely any energies is what I feel like painting. And I really no, not yet, He's on his way. Really, really, really want to get back to him. Really? See, I want to grow up to be able to paint like Anthony. She's sweet and that's why they are happy. They're all happy because they're getting bread. Wouldn't you get happy? Never mind. Nope. Not going there. Not going to say a word. Not touching it. You're very loud. Who is? The geese. They're not bothering me. I, uh, like geese. I, I, I muted the microphone. No, they're fine. They don't bother me. I'm used to them. You just take pictures of them, remember? Mm-hmm. Been a long time, but... Wow, that was a good catch. She threw the bread from behind the goose over his head, and he just picked his head up and caught it right in his mouth. Mm. That was pretty cool. So they actually feed them? Uh, yeah, they actually feed them. But once you feed them, they're yours for like however long you're here for. They will remember that and they will come back. The manager feeds them every morning. Yeah. Let's just read what we did in the book. Okay. Lance says he's coming. Kevin okay, said so Lance is coming, but he didn't make a reservation. So he thinks he's going to be able to pull up and just... I, I need a site, please. Did you make a reservation? No. Uh, that's a genius move right there. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to a thing where lots of people are going to be there. And you're going to assume that you can get in the door. I don't know, sometimes I wonder. <laughs> he ran away the other day when I said that to him, though, about the $50 thing. Heck yeah. He just disappeared. <laughs> Oof, God. How do you know Bruce likes getting goose, Kevin? <laughs> no. Sorry, no but Nothing to goose. Yeah, you need a butt to get goose. I can't believe Jim broke his suspenders. Who breaks suspenders? <laughs> yeah, I do. All the time. Yeah, but you at least you make use out of them. You know, they become fly spotters. Ah, uh, these are just threw up. <laughs> and he didn't even tell me they were the ones I got him for his grand staff uniform. Purple, purple ones? Yeah. Oh. 
I said, just put your purple ones on. Oh, I broke those too. Oh, really? When were you going to tell me that? <laughs> it's probably like, yeah, it wasn't on my list of things to worry about. <laughs> Very much. I mean, they're cheap enough anyway. He broke the buckle or something on him. I don't know. Yep, that's what I do. I fixed them like 20 times and then it's finally got to the point where it's like, they're, no, they're not good. Can't straighten them out anymore. Same guy that burns his shoes. Yeah, that's. Oh, that was like five minutes ago. Yeah, well, yeah. Well, they were slow today. No. <laughs> what? Just you. Yep. It's really humid down here. Really humid? Humid. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, terribly humid out. <laughs> yeah, that too. <laughs> we won't be here for the humid part. <laughs> Last weekend was very humid. Oh my god. Too many human. A lot of human. <laughs> <sighs> I don't really want to look what tomorrow happen. I mean, I do it. I don't. You know, I... Is anybody else helping her besides you? He is. Tyler is. Of course. That's right. Nicholas. Sue. As far as I know, that's it. Mostly because people are afraid of my dog. Yeah. I don't know why. Yeah, no. It's not like he's big or anything. No, he's just a <laughs> baby. <laughs> he's just a puppy. He's got a lot of growing left to do. Yeah. Sure, you might be done. <laughs> He's on the uh, the opposite direction. The downhill swing in his life. Well, he's past the estimated average, right? Oh yeah. So. I tell you something, but he's been taken very well care of and spoiled, and Kevin, are you bringing your entire house to the campground this weekend again? Why does he bring his whole house? What was it? Two weeks ago, he packed so much stuff in the back of the car. That he didn't have room for Betsy's bags because <laughs> he had a lawnmower in there. <laughs> okay, why does he have a lawnmower? The sites are well. The sites there are all grass. He's got a. He bought a seasonal site at the campground where M twenty one was. It's just don't they mow your grass for you? <laughs> That's what I would think. Usually, like here, you're responsible for anything that's on your patch of dirt. Except for leaves. They'll blow the leaves for you in the spring and in the fall, but... So you have to mow your own grass? I weed whack because I don't have enough grass to mow. <laughs> wow. Never had to do that.
they actually were very particular about it where we stayed. Mm, they, didn't, different. they didn't want you touching the grass. Remember we were talking about Snobville last week? Yeah. Well, at those two campgrounds, you can only have a certain type of shed. Like those tall, instead of like the one that we got, the bin. Yeah. The ones, you they have to have the ones that have the, the two doors on it. <clears throat> Can't have any other type of shed. There's like more regulations. What you can have and what you can't have. I don't know what it's like anymore, I guess. It's been a very long time. And the part of the run campgrounds are a whole lot different than if they're corporate. Just, you know. A lot of them here are selling out to corporate. I don't think that's going to happen too much for like Mike and. No. Although his location is getting to be a little more prime. But the campground's only got 26 sites. It's not like he's got this huge park with 600 sites he's going to maintain, you know? Except he's got the property attached to it, though. No. All right. He could probably double, double the size of his sights, I think. You but know, sometimes the building is nice, you know? I think he's got the room to put in more if he wanted to. You may not want to. On the other side of the tree line? Yeah. Yeah, he may not want to. He probably likes it just the size it is. And I'm sure a lot of the bigger campgrounds, like by Grand Isle and all that, are probably corporate owned. Right? I would think. Uh, no. No? They're private? Really? Okay. There's only a KOA up there. That's anything that's remotely large. Um, but, like, the other ones are all privately owned by families that have been up there a long time. Yeah. I figured that was, like, money, right? It's just like having it. Couple of farmers that you were farmers up there became campgrounds uh, 20 years ago, and they have big shacks now and stuff like that. But those are, those campgrounds over in that area are super expensive per night. Yeah. That's why I was wondering if they were corporate owned or not. But then I looked at the location, I was like, water, hello. Yeah. They looked at the house up there. Didn't want to deal in the winter time. <laughs> They're looking snazzy. Who's that? Your flowers. Oh. Yeah. Got that. Yeah, I want them.
we got our fingernails and toenails painted today. Manny Petty Spa Day. Uh, no. Alexis Spa Day. Oh. Alexis painted them. Oh. What color were they? Oh, I don't know. Four, four or five different ones. <laughs> That's whatever. She doesn't care. She's got to keep them that way on. She very rarely wears sandals, so. Has the car holding up? So far, so bad. Let you know tomorrow. After it's been loaded with junk for a day, we'll see what happens. Yeah. It's getting dark. Something's gonna happen. And don't say nighttime. I know nighttime is happening. <laughs> <laughs> kind of inevitable. <laughs> I'm sure no. <laughs> this thing called like this, you know, the Earth rotating around the sun and stuff. And I hear a rumor that it happens every day. Like clockwork. Give or take. I can't find my WD-4. Oh, I got PB Blaster in the back of the truck. Never mind. What am I worried about? Whoops. I'm noisy. I am noisy, too. 246. Oh, yeah, we don't want that number. Oh, right here. Sure, why not? What is that, Sonia? Whistling between my teeth. Okay. My mom does it. I'll tell your mom to stop too. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my world of OCD. Where little things really irritate the living crap out of you. Right. But big things don't even really phase you occasionally. Occasionally. Whistling and not a fan. Since probably, because, probably, probably because it hurts my ears. Yeah. <laughs> it plays havoc when I actually wear hearing aids, so the rest of the time it just. The brain automatically goes to instant annoyance. You might want to leave those out tomorrow. What? I said you might want to leave your hearing aids out tomorrow. I haven't been wearing them. I don't have any batteries for them. Okay. <laughs> hey, William. Hey, William. How are you? You'll be hearing, Dad, not there. No, put, put that over there. Dad, no, over there. <laughs> no, it'll be here. Put it where you want it. I'm leaving. Put it where you want it. I'm leaving. You're more than capable of moving stuff after I leave. I'm not setting up her house. I 
Are you not one of those staging teams? No. <laughs> we have two totally different tastes. Actually, we don't, but that's beside the point. You know, I don't understand the weather, right? Okay, it happens every day also. No, but they can't get it right from day to day, but yet they can predict a thunderstorm down to the minute. I don't, I don't get it. Why am I even thinking about that? I don't know. How am I bringing it? Uh, did you ever see any of that meteor shower the other night? Or? It's 1 a.m. I, I was asleep. You were sleeping? Wait, what happened? Occasionally. <laughs> it's called medication. Kicks me at 10 o'clock. I can tell about it. Two. Four hours. Yep. And it's whatever it happens to feel like. About almost 10 o'clock on the dot. If I wait until 10 o'clock and then sometimes I fall asleep in the chair. <laughs> so when I start feeling it, I go to bed. Unless you said Ted in, Ted in there for something who causes chaos. He always goes in there before I go. <laughs> he doesn't stay out with me. Okay. She goes to bed, he goes with her. It's just how he is. I gotta walk him and then he goes in. But if she's not if I'm not upstairs and she's in the bedroom, he has to be in there. Yeah. He's gotta be around soon. That's who he protects just a tad bit more than anyone else in this house, except for Alexis. She can't be in a different room than he is. He will get up and walk in the other room to see where she is. That's just how the puppy is. Yeah, that's how they all are. My aunt's dog was the same way when I was a kid. I always sat, the guy was sitting on the floor, he, he would sit right in front of me. And if somebody's visiting, he's between them. He will actually climb on the couch. But she's going to be mad because the couch is sleeping. <laughs> She's taking my couch with her. Oh no. I don't want it anymore. I suppose you only nap on the love seat. I just don't want the extra stuff in my house. <laughs> right. Take a recliner too while you're at it. Yeah, I've asked. I don't know if she got the room for him. It's fun to get the tape off this after, I don't know how long, a couple days. You mean it's not falling off a couple days, really? I don't know, it's been what, three days since I put the tape on this thing? One day I didn't paint it. One day I painted the stupid ugly flowers that are underneath it. Oops. Yeah. Okay. I did exactly what I tell myself not to do. Whatever. I don't care. 
thing. Yeah, that's okay. I'm headed out anyway. I just messed up my painting. I have a good night, William. What? Whoa. I should, I should really give up on flowers. Why? They're getting they get better all the time. Oh my god. I like it better like that. See what I did to the corner. Messed it all up though. You know what? I have a I, I have a painting of yours that you gave me that has the corners like that on purpose. Yeah. That yeah. I, I used to tear the tape so it was ratty on the edge. But thank you all for hanging out. I appreciate it. I'm going to head out. Got a long day tomorrow and I'm exhausted. Hey, I got one of those too. Um, be well, sign it, drive safe. As always. And I will see you guys all again soon. Be well.